welcome back. Today it is, what day is it today? It is Wednesday because the kids did not go to school or girls not been to school all week this week, all like any day this week at all. But because the kids have been off school sick, you kind of lose track of the days even more than normal. So the kids are all in the living room. Nobody is at school or nursery today because everyone apart from Oban is vomiting or got a sore stomach and not sending them to school. Primarily because, could you imagine going to school and like being sick on yourself? So they're actually like, they're all right. Sky's feeling a bit sad, like a bit down, a bit Ugh. But the rest of them are okay, but could you imagine going to school and then having like an accident at school, like being sick on yourself or not making it to the toilet in time or something. So just keep, keep them off. Um, today, Sky has a sore tummy and she's not feeling well. Our girl has a sore tummy and TMI, but <laughs> has not been out of the bathroom all morning. So they are, they're not really fit to go to school. So what we're gonna do is, I'm gonna let them go out to play in the garden because look at that weather, guys. Look, you can't even see outside in the garden because it's still sunny. But yeah, I'm gonna let them go out to play. We've got fresh jammies on and they can go out to play in their jammies. I got um, showered and stuff. I got fresh jammies on too. And yeah, we're just going to chill. I'm going to let them play in the garden, I think. And we're going to do like homeschool so that obviously I don't know exactly what they're doing in school at the moment, but so they're kind of doing something. Um, and I think we'll maybe do some read aloud, which is where like, <laughs> which is where like you read to your kids whilst they're playing, um, maybe like with Lego or something like that. But I'll take you guys in, you guys can see them. You guys are made to be sick. Which one of you is sick? Me. Sky's not well. Or Gail, you look pretty good or now. Although, I was telling everybody you've not been out of the bathroom all morning, haven't you? Not? No. You won't put your cereal below away. This little one is the only one that is feeling good. That He's feeling better. Ah! <laughs> How are you today, Obi? Good. Good. What's your plans for today? Eat your face. What are you going to do today? Mm. You just want me to do that again. <laughs> What's your plans for today? Um, what do you want to do? Um, not go to nursery. Not go to nursery? Okay. <gasps> What's your plans for today? I don't know really. You don't know? How are you feeling? Sore. Sore? What's sore? Just your tummy? Is your head better? <laughs> yeah, well that's good. Well, how about you just chill out? Do you want to play in the garden? No. Okay. okay. I'm going to get. I'm going to front you off some like home school work, and you guys can do some work. Okay. okay. Deal. Yeah. Then can I go on some dog? You can go on some dog. Oh, maybe later. Thomas has been taking these vitamins, guys. He uses them all the time. Like they're his favourite ones. I think they're called Super One. They're from Holland and Barrett. But look at the size of them. That's like, like that's nearly like as wide as my glasses. Like seriously. Like that 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 tablet is huge. They are so, so, they are so, such good vitamins. They really do work really, really well, but they're just like so huge. I take, and like a big kid, I take, um, you know, like, no, it's not for you, Poppy. <laughs> I take the kids, like chewy vitamins. They're, they're the kind of ones I like to take because I'm a big baby and I hate swallowing tablets when they're this size. Like that is humongous. Like, look, that's big. But anyway, I'm gonna take them because they're really good. They are really good ones. They give you so much energy. Um, not like in like a like caffeine, like pro plus kind of way, but just in a way that they're just full of so many good vitamins for you and stuff. What do you want? No, it's not for you. <laughs> but yes, I'm going to take it. I'm going to try and take it because honestly, I hate swallowing tablets at the best of times. Never mind when they're this size. So but I'm going to take it. Yes. It also, this is a bit TMI. This is like a TMI day for you guys, but it makes your pee really yellow. So I don't know, I don't know what's in it, but it makes your pee really yellow. <laughs> Tablet taken, oh, it was horrible. I always feel like it's really stuck in my throat, but yeah, that's it taken now. But I wanted to speak to you guys. Me and Thomas last night, we were talking about on a Monday, um, putting up an extra video for you guys, six, six o'clock, I can't speak today at six o'clock 
on our channel, on the same channel that we have, it just being a video with me and Thomas in it. So I know some people do like kind of Marriage Monday type videos. There's quite a lot of them about. So I was thinking that me and Thomas on a Monday could just do a video as a bonus video with just me and him in it. Because he's at work and he works, you, you guys know, Thomas works so much for me and the kids and so I don't need to go out to work. I feel like you kind of miss out on seeing him in the vlogs during the week. So I thought it would be a good way for you guys to get to know Thomas a little better and for Thomas to be in our videos more. So the first one we're going to do is our Q&A video for you guys. So that will be up on Monday at, at 6 o'clock and then we've got some other ideas like challenge videos, you know like Chubby Bunny, the baby food challenge, stuff like that. So if you guys have any ideas for videos you would like just me and Thomas. What's wrong Poppy? For videos you would like just me and Thomas to do, put them in the comments below. Thomas is home from work guys and he got me the best present a woman could ever ask for. Not just any woman. Look at this huge, huge bag of cumin. I sent him to Morrison's. Well, I asked him to go to Morrison's now. I, I sent him to go to Morrison's and he says, please can you go and get some cumin because I'm making enchiladas for dinner and we are all out of cumin. But normally I just buy these kind of little bags which are still quite big bags. What are you doing? <laughs> which are still quite big bags really compared to these little um these little tiny tubs but you guys can see the size difference in the packet that got me. So I'm super happy. I'm easily pleased, easily pleased. But Thomas is home from work and he's got growth group tonight. Yeah. Don't you? Man's club. Man's club, yeah. But the um, the guy who takes um Growth group or pastor, he's actually away to Germany. <laughs> he's away to Germany at the moment on a mission trip. So the guys are still going to get together, but they're going to do it in somebody else's house. I made a big tray of enchiladas. They taste lovely. A little bit of cheese is for me. Now we just need to go in the oven, get this cheese all melty, and then enchiladas will be served. Oven has drawn me a lovely picture. What is your picture of? Um, mummy. Mummy. Having a baby. Having a baby? Yeah. Oh no, no more babies for us. Please. It's got wheels. It's got wheels? The baby's got wheels? No. Only the bed has wheels. The bed has wheels? Oh, that's lovely. Where's my face? Um, right now. Oh, it's so beautiful. Yeah, do, do, do you want to smell? My smile is fabulous, thank you. I have to draw your glasses. You're going to draw my glasses? Oh good, thinking what you're drawing. I'm not. I'm writing some letters. I'm writing some letters, okay. I'm just back from growth group and I've got this weird heavy feel and I feel like my feet have been really, really heavy. <laughs> like I'm stuffing my shoes. Oh. I can't even figure out what it is, but I feel, I don't know if it's just because I've been to the gym today and I've done like day. And they're so heavy and I just can't hmm. walk. But do you guys think, do you notice anything oh. different about your shoes? Oh, my legs. Oh, my legs. These <laughs> <laughs> <These> are funny. <laughs> mm. Got a pair of ants stuck to my shoes, that's what it is. Are you boys going to go and brush your teeth? No. Ants Come on, teeth, toilet, bed. I'm yeah. just going to sleep in a bed all night. Me. Me. Yeah. What are you yeah. barking me. at, Poppy? Not me. Not me. Not me, you? Me. Bobby. I won. What are you backing at? What are you backing at? Bobby. Thomas put up the picture. You guys remember if you Bobby. followed us from when we lived in our old house, we had this picture up in our living room. And where was it in our living room? These are pictures from when me and Thomas got married. Although I think some of the actual like pictures need replaced. Like look at that one. That one's kind of like faded mm. looking. I don't know. What's up with those coloured ones? But yeah. So these are some of the pictures. From our wedding. Look how good my nails looked. Yeah, it's because you got a manicure. <laughs> <laughs> Do you remember that? Was that your first manicure? Yes. Yeah, Thomas got a manicure a couple of days before we got married. And that was Hello. apparently his first manicure. Just so his nails looked nice, because obviously you're going to be taking I don't, big pictures hands. like this. Yeah, Thomas has got like big man oh, hands. Weird. Like rough what? and cut. Look at his little lobe and look how tiny he was with his dummy in his mouth. <laughs> and that's Thomas and Thomas's best friend Mark. Then there's the boys. There's Sky Did I. There's a shoe shot. A shoe shot. I know, I never knew that was a feet. thing, a shoe there's, shot when you told me that. Shoes. Hands. Anything. What, baby? 
There's you married. That's mummy and daddy when we got house. married. That's right. I know our old house and our old wallpaper. Ooh. Thomas brought home these. What are they? Cookies? Yeah. Biscuits? They're uh, basically the equivalent of Scottish shortbread. Right. But they're biscuits from the Filipinos. Philippines? From Filipinos? Philippines. Thomas. From the Philippines. Philippines. The person that Thomas went to growth group with tonight, Els, him and his wife Dali, they are from the Philippines. So, did they get them when they went back home? Yeah, that's just, yeah, that's just their equivalent to shortbread. Classic Paul, Paul Voron. I'm probably slaughtering that. I'm sorry, guys. I'm very sorry, but we're going to taste it and we're going to see what it tastes like. Hey, right, you go first. <laughs> I hate trying new things, guys. I hate it. I'll let Thomas see what it tastes like. It just looks like our shortbread, doesn't it? Looks like a wee scone that didn't rise. What do you think? Just like shortbread. Yeah, but you would you would say that just so that I eat it and it would be disgusting. We do that sometimes too when we smell candles in the candle shop and they smell horrible mm -hmm. and we say, ooh, yeah, and we let the other person smell it and they smell disgusting just so they smell the disgustingness as well. It's like a mixture of shortbread and tablet. I thought it tastes like baby rusks. A baby rusks, yeah! <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it tastes like rusks. Yeah. Here you have Alan Tonal with that other one. You have that one. <laughs> you might be the baby. But thank you for joining us today, guys. Me and Thomas are going to go and get our Gilmore girls on. With some extras. With some extras. Don't show them the extras. I don't think we're greedy. I don't think we're very greedy. Mm. <laughs> but yeah, thank you for joining us today, guys. The kids are going to stay off school again tomorrow because they still weren't um, feeling that great. So we'll probably stay off for the rest of the week now. But thank you for joining us. Hope you enjoyed our vlog very much. You want to say anything to everybody? Just hi. Hi. <laughs> no, just comment. And if you like the video, give it always give that thumb up. And if you're not already subscribed, subscribe. See you later on. Bye.